So for this video, I'm using this Outre Purple Pack Straight Hair. It's premium blend and it's supposed to be virgin volume press, 18, 20, and 22 inch. And it has a deep lace closure. So I'm using that. And then I have a make your own wig, extra large dome cap, wig glue, wig, I said wig glue, this is track glue y'all, track glue, some thread, weaving needle, and I have a brush, and I'm probably going to use my blow dryer, but I'll let you guys know. So far, I have just my dome cap, and I took the closure out. As you guys can see, the closure is a rectangular shape, and you just put your closure down. I used um, stick pens like these, like regular ones from like on a, um, a classroom board, and you a bulletin board. And I just, um, you know, pinned it down so that it was tight and secure, and then I sewed all the way around the closure. And I just had the hair up in the top knot so that when I glue my tracks around, you know, it won't be in the way. So that's how far I am right now. I'll give you guys an update once I start gluing the tracks on. I actually tried it on with just the lace closure. And it lays really good on your forehead. I mean, I've seen a lot of videos where it looks kind of wiggy on people. I don't know. I, I, I guess I'll judge it at the end. But to me, it looks, it looks pretty good. So, I'll update you guys in a little bit. So I'm just checking in to give y'all an update on this hair. I'm about halfway done. I have the tracks layered up to about the middle of the back of my head. And I have like two coming up to around the top. So I'm going to start layering them around all the way to the top until all the spaces are full. And so far so good. I just got the closure up in a bun so I can see what's going on. So I can probably get a little view of the back. I don't know if I can see it or not. But I'll be back when I'm done. Alright, so this is the finished product. I put my part on the side instead of the middle. It, it y'all, like I seen on some other reviews, it did look kind of wiggy in the middle. It just looked a little weird. But I put it on the side, and y'all, it's, it's cute. Like I'm feeling it. Is she cute? She is cute, honey. Hmm. And I didn't really have to do too much to the part. Like it actually looks kind of natural on the side already. So I just put um, I used this little dollar uh eyeshadow palette from Dollar Tree. And I just used a little of um, this little neutral color. And I like lightly dusted the part so it looks a little bit more natural. I used that one right there. And this was a little, this is a dollar. This is what I bought this for. I actually bought this for part. Like I'm, I'm cheap. I'm not spending $10 and $20 on concealer that's going to go on a part. So that's what it is, y'all. And thank you for watching. And I would say, I mean, a lot of the reviews say this hair is going to be tangly. But that's synthetic hair for you. So, if you're a girl like me on a bargain, honey, you just make it work. Because I'm going to brush, blow dry, all that to this hair. And it's going to be bomb. Like, I, I just like it. See y'all.